everybody and welcome back to a nice video. Today we're hopping into the seventh episode of the first season of Lucifer titled Wing Man. Um, so just a disclaimer, um, I my allergies are going haywire right now for the last couple of days. It's been crazy. I'm so congested. Like I wake up every morning and it feels like there's so much pressure everywhere in my head from my ears to my head to my nose, my throat, everything. Uh, so, you know, I take a bunch of medicine and it gets better throughout the day, but, um, yeah, my allergies go crazy every fall and this year, for some reason, it seems to be worse than usual, or maybe I'm misremembering how crazy my allergies get, but, um, yeah, they're going magic crazy right now. So, um, if I sound nasally, if you see me sniffling, if I'm sneezing or coughing and like, I'm doing the best I can. Um, like I physically, I feel fine. Like I don't feel sick. It's just everything here is just very congested. So uh, if you have allergies, you probably understand all of this. Um, so I just want to let you know, because uh, I am enjoying the show. I am enjoying doing these reactions. And I just hope that the nasaliness of my voice and things like that uh, don't distract from um, the reaction and enjoying this show because I really am enjoying uh, Lucifer and all these other shows that I'm reacting to, enjoying all of them. So um, just wanted to put that out there to see so you guys know um, what's going on. So there's that. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to get into this next episode of Lucifer. Last time we ended on Lucifer's wings getting stolen. So I'm excited to see who did it, how they did it, and all this whole mystery that's surrounding this. So I know I'm excited to get into it. Um, if you want to see my full reaction super early, you can head on over to my Patreon page. The link is in the description below, so be sure to go ahead and check that out. But if you want to stay right here on YouTube and wait for them to show up, that is perfectly fine. Just be sure that you like, comment, and subscribe so that we can help grow this awesome channel and awesome family here. So I'm ready to hop into this episode. I know Grogu, Grogu's more than ready. So let's get into it. This is the seventh episode of the first season of Lucifer titled Wingman. Let's go. All right, Maze. I'll see you. <laughs> Oh shit! He's like killing the motherfucker. My wings, where are they? My wings! I don't even know what you're talking about. I really wonder if this human stain's actually telling the truth. No, he's scum. He'll say anything. It's not him. It's us. Us. What? But you're tortured. What you do? Professional. Oh, like, fine. I'll let him live. It would make everyone's life easier if you would close your investigation. You have 24 hours. I'll let it go and let his family. Okay. No. To, I don't know. Chat about it or something. The sex is always on the table. What do you do when your case hits a wall? Grab a pair of fresh eyes. Someone who's not going to be afraid to be honest with me, even if it's not what I want to hear. That's a brilliant idea. Her? Yeah. Maybe. Then to help each other. There you go. You. There you go. Oh, maybe not. What? Who? What? Oh. I've asked you here because those same wings have been stolen. And I need your help to get them back. Yep. Will you help me or not? The one in the carnival, buddy. Well, fix your own damn mess for once. Damn it, man. Well, now you gotta go back to Chloe. Hi. Okay, what was in there? My angel wings. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, come on, get it away. <laughs> okay, seriously. <laughs> what was in there? <laughs> His angel wings. <laughs> oh, you are serious? I will put out an APB on... Um. Angel wings. Angel wings. Oh. Hey, hey Dan, what's up? Yeah, you weren't around to help, so I recruited someone else. Yeah, the exactly. Three of us working again. Teamwork. Cool. It was Malcolm and Audi and his bodyguard. They looked like they were making a deal. He saw me. Damn it. He didn't react, he just went back to his conversation. And that's when the shot went off. Malcolm was on the floor bleeding out. What the hell happened here? There's nothing we could do. What if someone else was here? What if I was wrong? I don't think we'd go all through this if you were wrong. Uh, yeah. Did you really put out an APB for angel wings? 
Well, it looks like they got a hit. Excellent. <laughs> right, my turn. I still can't believe that the wings are real, exquisite, divine. They look great. So how do we get the wings back? After the raid, as long as you can prove the wings provenance, you get it back in 30 days. No problem. In 30 days. Yeah, that's not gonna work for him. <laughs> He's like, nope, I want it back, and I want it back now. Damn, he looks good. Like, he always looks good, but damn. Ah, oh, he's looking good too, man. All right. They belong in the heavens where they were created. If you don't want them, that's where they'll be. Though it appears that you've picked up a fashion sense. That's, uh, right? I miss the dress. <laughs> this coin, what is this coin? Well, they're finally bringing that up. To so keep focusing on it, says the pilot. The coin's not for sale. I simply used it to gain entree to you. Then why are you here? Someone stole my wings. <laughs> oh, you men don't know who you're dealing with. Those guns don't frighten us. Oh, they frighten him. Go ahead. See what happens. It's like he can get hurt. He can get hurt. I'm more than happy to buy the wings. If you truly worship Dollar, then I'm your ticket to divinity. Since when is the Prince of Darkness scared of some insufferable human gun? I've led. What do you mean? Oh, he doesn't know? I thought maybe he had done something. All I have to do is wait for some pitiful thug to end you. And right back to hell you go. Hmm. You put that one together, you Nope. You don't know the Hey. I was waiting for her to show up. Lucifer, your brother got all the charm in the family. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> he just doesn't like that, does he? There it is. It's like, fine, fine. I wonder how long it's going to take her to actually start believing he's actually Lucifer. That's not them? Oh. So where are the real wings? Oh, I saw him come in here. That's the secret door. These aren't my wings. Whose wings are they? Someone with a warped sense of humor. But there's something at Palmetto that I need to take care of, so... My wings are still out there. I need to find them. So I came here to save your ass, but just because these wings aren't the ones you wanted, that's it? We're done? So much for quid pro quo. He's got a point, um, yep. You sure you don't want to chase after her? Maybe I can ask Father for some rain and make it a moment. Well, I'm afraid this is where I leave you, brother. Why? What I'm about to do is the devil's work. What the hell is he about to do? I'm 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 kinda scared. I'm kinda scared. Father, no one could have shot Malcolm and fled without me seeing them. Now you're making my point. Because there was no obvious exit. But maybe there was a secret one. Chloe. I don't know. There it is. Except there it is. Hello. Oh, no. There they are. Oh, that's a cool yeah. shot. Who tipped you off? Is it the angel? I knew you'd come. Of course I'd come. Yep. I think it was the angel, right? Oh shit! What are you doing? Well, running your panties, eh? Hey? Yup, it was the angel, yup. You took Carmen off and you orchestrated the theft. Because you left me no choice. <laughs> Damn, I actually did not see that twist coming though. In case I haven't made myself abundantly clear, I'm never going back to hell. <laughs> He's like, you motherfucker. Ah, 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 ah. You can actually bleed now, like, come on. That stopped him. That stopped him. This is far from over. I'll do whatever it takes to get you back to hell. I believe him. He's like a brother to me. And for the last eight years, he was the best damn partner that I could ask for. Was it this cop that shot him? I'm sorry. I believe I'm her. I'm the case against him. To a good cop. But on a show. To milk. And I know you made a vow. But nothing. I am with 
ridiculous for, from mm. now until the end. Okay. Thirteen. Yeah. And I can't pretend to understand why the wings meant so much to you. But if we're really friends, it, it should be enough to slow you down. The wings are old news now. <laughs> She's like, wait, after all of that. I found something. To our equally enigmatic futures. Mm. Maze is not happy. What does it mean if she still has one feather? Aww. That's sad. What's happening? Wait, what? Oh, hey! Hmm, what's his play here? Alright, let's go ahead and talk about it. Well, that was the seventh episode of the first season of Lucifer titled Wing Man. And this was a really good episode. Um, I really liked that there really wasn't any procedural going on except for like both Chloe and Lucifer trying to find out their respective cases, which was awesome. Um, so we had Lucifer who was trying to find his wings. There was this auction that he found him at. And, um, he ended up getting him back, but, like, he ended up burning him on the beach. Like, whoa, I did not see that coming, because I know that he was diehard to get his wings back, and his, you know, angel brother helped him, and everything else. Like, that was a cool team-up. I loved their team-up. That was great. I loved their dynamic with each other. Um, I love the fact that, you know, the angel was like, you know, shoot away, <laughs> and Lucy was like, no, 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 I can die. But I also didn't make the connection that, like, if Lucifer got shot he and died, he would go back to hell where he belongs. So I was just like, hmm, all right, so Lucifer's going to have to be a lot more careful. But that whole dynamic between Lucifer and, and, the, and his brother, that was great stuff. I really liked that. I really liked that team up. And then at the very end, when I did not see the twist that it actually was his brother that, that had his wings, stolen but that actually does make sense that he would do that um because he's just trying to get lucifer like back to hell he's trying to do anything to get him back to hell and the way it's very interesting that he was the one that orchestrated all this then on top of that he brought back malcolm so like what was what's going on with that was it a deal that he made was it um Malcolm knows something that he needs to bring him back. Like, I'm curious as to what he's doing all that for. Like, is he doing it for Chloe so Chloe can close the case and figure out what happened that night? Like, I'm curious as to what Malcolm has to say about what happened that night. And I'm really glad that we also got to, because they kind of mentioned it in the pilot and then in his last episode or an episode or two ago, I can't remember. But, like, she was mentioning what happened um, that night, and uh, I'm glad we got to actually see what happened, the Palo Alto. Like, we got to actually see what was happening, which was really cool to see. I'm glad we're getting a lot more background on the Palmetto case. And um, so, apparently, there is someone on the inside who was the one that actually killed all of them. So, or killed, um, the guy they were looking for and killed Malcolm, killed Malcolm. Um, so obviously I think it was the cop who was like at the wake who was talking. Um, obviously I'm pretty sure it's him cause they're, they keep bringing him back, but I'm curious as to like how they're going to find the clear cut evidence outside of the key. So they do know it was a cop. And I'm curious to see what all happens there. So, um, all in all, a great episode. Um, I know a lot of you guys have been saying, you know, all the police procedural stuff is, like, in the background. So, like, all, like, all of this is, like, really cool. This is actually one of my favorite episodes so far. It was really good. I liked all the angel, like, all the stuff to do with Lucifer and the angel in heaven. Like, all that's awesome. And so, obviously, I think it's going to keep getting more and more into that. So, uh, I'm excited to see where the show goes with all that. And, um, yeah, like, this was a good episode. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, I'm curious as to how Chloe's going to... And it was smart of Chloe to um, say that she's closing the case because they're not going to be watching her because she says she's closed it. So, uh, yeah, so... 
um, yeah, this was a this was a really good episode. I thoroughly enjoyed it, and I'm wondering why like May still has the feather. So like, what does that mean? Is they able to like grow new wings? Is it just like a keepsake? Is it like I don't know? So I guess we're gonna find out. But uh, I hope you guys. Uh, enjoyed my reaction to this episode. Hope you guys are enjoying all my reactions. If you want to see the full episode, head on over to my Patreon page. The link is in the description below. Or hang out right here on YouTube. That's fine. Just be sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you for the next episode.